Call well, let's hit this caller and then. Uh, Dean's World, going once. You paid five bucks, nigga. <laughs> going twice. <laughs> Yo, we can hear you. <laughs> All right, but, Chris gets hey, mad for uh, y'all when you don't answer the guys, phone uh, and you pay. Go ahead, bro. Yeah. Uh, what's going on, guys? Uh, just want to shout out you guys. Really proud of y'all hitting a million. I've been following y'all since 30,000. Uh, great to see the progress, and I love what you guys are doing. Keep it up. So Thanks, I'll bro. keep my question brief and concise. Um, to give some background, I'm in the Army. I'm an officer right now. Cool. Uh, my body count is about, like, 50 to 60. Uh, so I've, I've been around. Obviously, Ryan's going to say that's nothing, nigga. And I'm going to be like, yeah, you're right. Uh, but that's my situation. So How old are you? I know I'm 22. Okay. Officer, yeah, yeah, I'm a, 50 I'm a to 60 lay count, only 22 years old. Hey, bro, you're fucking hot shot right now, my friend. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate it. But uh, these days, I, I got a problem. So, uh, ooh, voice crack. Um, What's the problem? So what happened was uh, I met this girl. She's also an army officer. She here with me. Uh, body count six. Traditional woman. Nigga, how do you know? Uh, uh, she told me. And also, <laughs> if if you were if you were around, her, she's not she's not like most of them. Uh, and so we've been talking for a while. She's here with me, uh, doing training, and she really likes me. She's saying, "Yeah, I, I see a future with you." This time, the third. And we already started talking about like long, like long term relationship, all that stuff. Oh, nope. The problem is, and this is my question: the problem is, she wants to save it for marriage. <laughs> bro, and you can't be serious, bro. Like me, <laughs> you can't be serious, bro. You can't be serious right now. <laughs> bro, he's trolling, man. A nigga like me is no, like he's serious. I know fresh. Fresh swears up and down the best pussy is new pussy, and it's like nigga, like I get it, but like it's something about this girl that's like fuck, man. Like I might, might be worth it. But okay. then I think back to every single thing that Myron and y'all be saying on the show, and I'm like, I know if I go on this show, they gonna clown my ass. But I just had to ask. No, so, it's fine. You know why? Because my situation, even though I'm you're asking, even though you're asking yeah. this question, I guarantee you, there's probably ten or twenty guys in the chat right fucking now that are in the same situation as you. So. You know, they'll make fun of you, whatever, but they're probably in a similar predicament. Let me ask you a couple questions about this girl. How old is she? She's also 22. She's 22. All right. And uh, did she go to, well, she obviously went to college, right? Because she's an officer just like you. Yep. Where'd she go to school? She went to Nebraska University. How many kids go to, go to that school? Uh, she said it's not a big school. I think Max is probably like, Mo, Mo, double, Mo, double check for me real quick. Nebraska State University, you said? Yep. Okay. Was she in a sorority? No. She did just straight ROTC? Yeah, she was. Uh, she did Army ROTC. And, uh, I went to West Point, so I didn't do that. But it... You went to West Point? Okay. Good. Not nice. Good school. Um, and <laughs> 50K. And are both of her parents together? Yeah, it's a big school. Uh, 50,000 yeah. kids go to school there. Uh, both of her parents are together and she's 22, yep. you're 22 and she's uh, an officer. Bro, I I'm going to keep it all the way 1,000 with you. I doubt her lay count is only six. I heavily, heavily doubt that. She went to a big ass <laughs> state school um, and she's in the military. So just the, pro the probability is extremely slim. Uh, she's telling you that because she knows that that matters to you. Does she know that you watch this kind of content? Probably, right? Nah. Sit on the wrap. Hold she on. Is she next to you right now? No, no, no. She's gone. I made sure she left. Okay. All right. Yeah, bro. She and you actually asked her, or did she tell you straight up without you volunteering it, or without? Or she did she just volunteer it without uh, you asking? She asked me, and then I was like, I'm not gonna ask you. Some girls get touchy over that, and she told me she said it was sick. Yeah. See, um, usually, right? There's well, too many red flags yeah, here, bro. But, like, went to a big state school. Yeah. In in the military, I'll keep it at that. A lot of women that are in the military, bro, uh, just higher late counts because they're around dudes all the time, get dug, dick offerings all the time. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, man. Twenty two years old, is she, and you said she's attractive. I'm assuming she's probably attractive. If you're actually like thinking about something here, yeah, she's a she's a nine. She said that she went on a date with Troy Palomaro's nephew. Yeah, see, so, like okay, the football player. Man, usually, right? What happens here is that a girl. I said, I had many options in her life. Our Lord Dick will say, you know what? I'm going to wait till marriage because she's already had her full. She says, you know what? Next guy I meet, I'm going to tell him what he wants to hear. I'll play the game. Yep. So, bro, when, when I ask the question, 
how do you know her body count? You said she told me. I was like, bro, you can she never lying. trust a girl, bro. Yeah. Because off rip, she'll tell you what you want to hear. No, secondly, bro, you're young, you have your life ahead of you, bro. If you marry this chick, and if she's capping on any level, she can fuck your life up. So, bro, here's what you do, right? Here's what you test her real quick. It's, it's, it's a finesse game one on one. You said, look, babe. I want you to I'm a seller dream. I want you to <laughs> like, you know what? I feel the energy, I feel the vibe. Like, we can see where this goes. And you know what? Let's get married. You get married though, not by the, the state, but by the church. So you take her to church, you go to your family, you marry her in church. And she says to you, Oh no, has to be by the, by the state or I want a real wedding. Call it off. But just see what, just see her, just see her, her response, and then go from there. But I'm telling you right now, bro, she's full cap. Full cap. And not only that, bro, you don't pay full price for something that other people have gotten for free. That's Facts. fucking stupid, nigga. Like, Facts. like, would you go to a car salesman and pay, uh, you know, twenty thousand dollars MSRP for a Mustang that has, you know, twenty thousand miles on it? Nope. Like, when it, that's the retail price, like, fuck no, bro. Even like, that's even with the caller earlier. Dealers aren't taking the car back for full price. Yeah. Under market value. Hell no. It's been used. Hell no, bro. It's it's yeah. And and on top of that, like that six number, fuck no. That's cap, man. That's one thousand percent cap. Uh, there's just too many. Um, indicators of uh, uh, too many, w way too many fucking red flags for, for for it to only be six. And the fact that she's trying to get commitment out of you this quickly, right? And she's that attractive. Red flag, bro. That is a huge red flag in itself, too, man. So, Tester. Bro, I, I, I've said it before. No hymen, no diamond. Y'all y'all get mad at me for saying that shit, but, bro, nah. And you can play, go ahead and play Freshest Tactic if, if you want, but fuck no, bro. She's she's capping. She's 1,000% capping. See, issues of virgin... All bets are off. Cool, but she's not a virgin, she's, bro. There's no way. Yeah, six bodies, six hell no. Six, fifty thousand. Six. She was at ROTC. She went to big ass party school. And she's bad. Fifty thousand. And she's a trainer. Nine. Fuck and she's out officer too. Yeah, bro. Uh, six uh, military. Six no, times nigga. six, nigga. Officer? No, no she minimum. Didn't. No man. Uh, like <laughs> yeah, one thousand percent cap. What I think, if anything, is that her body count is extremely high. high. She's tired of being on the fucking streets. Facts. So she's what she's gonna do to you is she's gonna sell you what purity. That's what girls do. They sell purity to try to get locked down. That's what she's trying to do. And not to mention the other problem that you're running into here is that you guys are both in the military. Bro, are, I hope she's not She's not in your chain of command or anything like that, right? I'm assuming she's an officer. You're an officer. You guys are completely no. separate? Yeah, no. We have the same rank, so she's not, yeah. Okay, but... Bro, and then and then the fact that you're, you're because here's the other thing too that you're not even thinking about. Let's say you commit infidelity or some shit like that, bro. They could they could hit you with uh with uh, uh military jail with for that. That's like a violation, yeah. and and you're you're just inviting potential other issues to hit you in the military for getting married with another military chick, bro. Fuck no, hell no. Because if anything goes bad, she could always go to the jag and get you in trouble. <laughs> and they'll open an investigation for anything. Next thing you know, fucking not the FBI, but Army CID or your Army, right? Yeah, because you went to West Point. Army CID yeah, opens yeah, CID. a fucking case and, on your ass. And we know, for, for a matter anything. of fact, military women are the most promiscuous you can yeah. find, yep. and nurses. Yeah, bro. Like, yo, Nurse. all she got to do is just it, if she has an inkling that you, because you're probably a Chad to some degree if you're 22 with a, with that high of a late count, bro. Like, it, she she could just be like, oh, he cheated on me, blah blah blah. You get in trouble for that in the military, bro. Mm. Bro, Adultery she, is, a, is a thing. <laughs> she belongs to the barracks. <laughs> ah! <laughs> she belongs to the street. That was actually funny, my friend. That was good. That was actually funny, my friend. Yeah, good man. Job. So, bro, don't do not do it, man. Don't do it. Like, at all. You got way too much to lose. The officer getting married to her, the military being involved, the fact that if anything goes wrong, you could be brought up into a fucking military court. And I'll tell you all this. The, the, the um... The military courts have the highest conviction rates because y'all niggas got like no rights. <laughs> look, I'll say this. Like none. Caller, you, you heard our advice for you, bro. And look, I'm telling you right now, you may go my wife up, you may go do your thing after. We get it. You might love her or whatever. But at the same time, remember that we told you so. When she divorces you, when you lose half your shit, when you get finesse, just remember, Fresh Marin told you so. Yeah, man, you got too much to lose, bro. I wouldn't, I wouldn't marry her, bro. And I wouldn't pay full price for something that other people have gotten for free. I definitely wouldn't, man. And I guarantee you know what? If you break up with her for not giving you box, she probably gonna come running back and give you box. Facts. Yep. And then you're gonna realize what the fuck. Yep. <laughs> All right, caller. Yeah, too much to risk, my friend. <laughs> and you're All too right, goddamn hey, young. Two, you guys have a good night. 22 years old, fuck no. All right, man. Peace. And thank you for your service, my friend. Yeah. Yeah. Benjamin Shade, man. Shade, man. F and F, man. Shout out to you, Yo, my friend. You think he, he gonna do it? I hope you don't send, bro. I hope you don't. Bro, right, stay strong, of, uh, my friend. S word.
Oh yeah, yeah. We gotta get off Twitch. Guys, All right, niggas, Twitch, we get off Twitch. Cut YouTube, get guys. Off YouTube. Uh, Mo, just use the talkback. <laughs>